guys, as Dave just mentioned, we're gonna try and do this toy hunt thing. And I'm gonna try and record it. Usually there's a ton of people, too much noise, and a whole lot of chaos. But we'll see what we can find this time around. So let's go. Hey guys, it's Dave's Dimension here. I am a local woman. Did grab these two. Did grab these two. Doctor Strange Multiverse Madness, and we got Astral Doctor Strange. Not a whole one. We just got the uh, hammerhead here. I got some new uh, McFarlane's. Got Lobo. We got Rock and Roll Superman, of course. Got the three Jokers. We got this uh, Superboy Prime. I said I was going to stay away from McFarlane. And they also got Swampy Thing. But I'm thinking I might have to get that Superboy Prime. What do you guys think? Do we have some The Batman? We got some uh, NECA TMNT. We got some retro turtles. If they got a full set, I might have to grab it. So oh, we got our turtle van. You know what that means. So it looks like I'm picking up turtles today, guys. And right, that's my Lando's. Lando, Lando, Lando in vintage and in black series. So yeah, they got everybody but Donnie. So I gotta grab them and I gotta get the I gotta get the party wagon. I just have to. I'm required by state law, guys. Oh, we got some uh, large multiverse of Madness figures here. We got the new He-Man uh, animated series. Still got some uh, Scully Gods. Moss Man. Might scan Moss Man to see if I can uh, get a good price on them. But, uh, yeah, that's what I have at my Walmart. Some new stuff. So it's a surprise. Some nice restocks. We never really get them here. Now, Transformers, they got a Roddy Boy. We got Bumblebee Soundwave. And I'm kind of tempted to grab him. Looks like he turns into kind of a weird, almost Insecticon like mode I'm curious to see what he's pricing at now my Walmart does not have um, scanners so I have to use the app to see what it really comes up at but we'll see what happens um, no Starscream yet for some reason they got some of the He-Mans mixed in with the Transformers but and yes we do still have Ghostbuster figures we got that Tigertron we got the Mini Fuff Mysteries and we got those uh, Ectos. Some Jurassics. Let's go over to NECA. Okay, we're approaching the NECA section right now. At least what passes for NECA section in my Walmart. Got Alien, we got Goliath. Oh, Iron Man in game, that's a little new for us. Got these uh, Wolverine Q figs, might have to grab one for 19. It doesn't seem too bad. And that was not a loud kid, that was a loud ass employee. Got some Funkos here. Got that WWE. Now we do got the Star, uh, Star Wars masks, but they're still f uh, 50 more. Let me check the pricing. But they look like they're still full price. Okay, so those masks won't even scan in my app. And I'm being told that they won't scan in the system either. So since they won't scan in the system, they won't even give me any offers. They won't let me purchase it. Everything else is showing the full price. So uh, I'm going to take my turtles, my Doctor Strange, and my party wagon. And we're going to get out of here. See you next time. I haven't seen these before. Flash Gordon. Original Superheroes by King Features. We got a Phantom. And we got me and Flash himself. These are pretty damn good. $34.95. Also came across these. They look pretty cool. It says 1990 or 1988 for those. Got none. Mole. The mole people and of course the invisible man 
I think I might want to get the Invisible Man, though. And we got Dr. Frankenstein and the Monster. Kind of tempted for that, but I don't know about the 44. I might play the long game, see if it goes down. The NECA section. Actually looks organized for once here. Just the usual suspects when it comes to Gundams. Got Predator 2. Halloween Kills, Aliens. The usual, but at least they're organized. Okay, so those who are big model kit fans and G.I. Joe, they got a Snake Eyes model kit. Kind of tempted to grab this. What do you guys think? Okay, so at Target, not a whole lot here. Usual suspects. Ten of McFarlane Batmans. Three Jokers, but I did pick up. We got the Boba, his ship, and also one of the mystery packs. So we're gonna open that up and see what we get. And for recap, right? So today was actually a pretty, pretty awesome uh, toy haul for me today, guys. Um, Honestly, usually when I go out of my area, go to Walmart, go to Target, GameStop, it's usually nothing. I usually don't come, hardly I ever come, come across anything. Uh, this time around, like I said, I was looking around my Walmart, and I came across these uh, Doctor Strange. This is Multiverse of Madness, Doctor Strange. So there's a nice little subtle difference you can see in the uniform, in his clothes. So I actually have Doctor Strange from... No Way Home, Spider-Man. So I'll be doing a comparison video when they do the unbox with this. Also, they had Astral Doctor Strange. Uh, this one doesn't purport itself as Multiverse of Madness, but it is from the same same line, obviously. We can see it right there. So I got this. And um, it's cool. I I mean, I from the pictures I've seen online, he looks really cool. A nice little Astral ghost version of him and we have the eye of egg egg magnon is removable here now i don't know why we have a genie lamp a lamp there uh obviously that's going to be something to do with the show or with the uh, movie itself but yeah i grabbed these two um they were at my walmart and also as you guys saw in the clips they got the vintage uh vintage style ninja turtles they had all of them except for Donatello. So if anyone out there knows uh, or can get, a, get me a line on a Donatello, I'd greatly appreciate it. So we got Mikey. We got Leo. And we got Raphael. <clears throat> now, as a kid, I did have these. So it's going to be cool to kind of have them again. Um, I'm curious to see how much of a difference these are. Now, these were the cards were banged up a bit. That's how they were on the... On the racks. Um, unfortunately, you know, it is what it is. Um, so, you got, but you guys know me. I'm usually an out of box collector, so I'm probably going to rip these open and set them up. Although, I'm half tempted to try and keep them in card, but the card's messed up. It's not going to hang. It's not going to hang well. This little piece is already busted on it. In fact, all of them, when they were put out there, they were, they were that way. Um, and I tried going through all of them. Obviously, these were just put out. I can tell they're just put out because there is a crap ton of Raphaels, Leos, and Mikeys, but no Roth or no no Donnies, which I thought was weird. I mean, we had maybe two or three pegs, maybe even four pegs of repeats. A little bit more Raphael than anything else, to be perfectly honest. Um, but yeah, my local Walmart had that, but they had something else. As you guys saw in the video, there was something else there that I, honestly I was gonna I was gonna kind of pass on these, but once I saw what they had. I couldn't pass it up. We got our party wagon, guys. Which means, as you guys notice, I'm making some extra room here. Yeah, you know the Ninja Turtles are going to get their own shelf. I mean, I have a NECA Turtle section, but now we're going to have to set this up. We're going to have we're going to have the party wagon in full in full motion. Yes, I am going to open this up. Uh, the box itself is a little it's dinged up. Uh, they had about four, maybe even six of these at the time. I grabbed one. I'm not being a greedy boy. So I grabbed one. And so, I mean, those I had to get. Now, those, uh, the Flash Gordon figures I saw, I've never seen those. I've seen the other ones that we see in Target and we see Walmart everywhere. But these uh, 
these other ones I saw, they look more like a, uh, almost like a NECA kind of style. Like if we gave NECA or McFarlane uh, the license for Flash, that's what it kind of looked like. They really look good. I'm not into collecting the Flash Gordon. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love the 1980s Flash. But, I mean, these, they it almost won me. If I wasn't buying all this, I would have been jumping on those too. So, um, so I mean, those and also the, uh, the Amigo, uh, Dr. Frankenstein and Monster. I said Frankenstein because it's from Young Frankenstein. Um, those look really cool. But the, uh, the other one. The monsters one where it had the mole people, the nun, and the invisible man. He looked really awesome. And for 20 bucks, I'm thinking I might actually go back. So we'll see what happens. Uh, but yeah, it was very cool. Uh, in fact, I also went to my local GameStop, used my monthly $5 coupon. I got an oldie. I got a classic for the Xbox, The Force Unleashed. I've actually never played this game. I'm a Star Wars fan. I've been playing a little, little bit of Battlefront. And of course, uh, Fallen Order. I love Fallen, Fallen Order. Um, but this, I think we're going to... I So this was on sale for like $19.99. I had my $5 coupon, so took it down to $15. We're going to throw this in the X Xbox. And I think this might be the first video for uh, Dave's Dimension Gaming, which is our sister channel or our brother channel, if you want to call it that. Uh, we've launched a second channel that's going to be dedicated to... Anything that's going to be on that channel is going to have to do with gaming and gaming only. So we're trying to expand the channel. And speaking of expanding the channel, I want to thank everyone who has been supporting Dave's Dimension uh, for the almost two years that we've been going. Uh, we, as of today, we're at 400, at the recording of this video, we're at 478 friends and family, 478 citizens of the Dimension. Uh, YouTube likes to use that word subscriber. Uh, so we're at 478. We're getting close to, we're on the road to 500. When we hit 500 and maintain that, for at least seven days. Yeah, oof, oof, you heard me, seven days. Uh, if, if we can maintain that for seven days, we will then give the dates and time for the uh, 500 uh, stream. We're going to do a live stream, I'm thinking maybe three, maybe four hours, where we'll do, we'll do maybe a little bit of building, we'll do some talk, and we'll do some giveaways. I said giveaways, plural. I'm thinking of doing more than one giveaway here. It's going to be an elimination wheel. But the only way you can enter <clears throat> is by going to the link below. I'm going to have a link directly to my 500 giveaway uh, announcement video, which I have. And that's got all the rules, guidelines, and stipulations. So if you're interested in jumping, uh, jumping in on that giveaway, you're going to click on that link and go directly there. Now, as always, guys, I just want to thank everyone who supported the channel. We're at, we hit 60,000 views, which I can't believe myself. We're over 350 videos uploaded. And we're over 475, we're at 478 followers, citizens, friends of the dimension. I can't thank you guys. I literally can't thank you guys enough, guys. We wouldn't be here. There would be no dimension if it wasn't for you. So we are the dimension, guys. So I just want to thank you guys. Thank you for coming along for this nice, fun toy, toy haul. We got some pretty awesome goodies. Of course, you can see I have, we have a whole backlog of Black Series I still have to unbox. So we still got a lot more to go. And we got a lot more coming through the pipeline. So please stick around. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give me a thumbs down. You got comments, questions, concerns, ideas. Maybe you're, you're a YouTuber yourself and you want to uh, team up for something. Let me know. Hit me up in the comment section below. Or better yet, you got socials right there at the bottom of the screen. You can hit me up at Dave's Dimension. Uh, Dave's underscore Dimension. On Instagram, you can always hit me up at Dimension Daves on Twitter. And if you want to donate or you want to help support the channel, there's a cash app. But I also have links to my stream elements uh, <clears throat> tip page as well. If you want to join that, <clears throat> excuse me. I've been doing a lot of upgrading to the channel. We want to try and bring the channel. We want to keep pushing forward and bring you guys the best content possible. So I just want to thank you guys. And you guys know what I'm going to say as always. I will always catch you on the flip side. Keep on busting.